So today I am unboxing the iPhone 7 and I just wanted to share with you guys my thoughts and a little review, pros, cons, all that good stuff. And you know, it just came out today. Today's September 16th. So, yes, let's go ahead and just get to the unboxing. Disclaimer, I've already unboxed this iPhone at my service provider's store. So, yeah, they helped me set it up and stuff and whatnot. Oh, let me show you the box. So, here's the box. So, here's the box. <clears throat> this is the iPhone 7 Plus in rose gold, and it is 128 gigabytes. So just an idea, I just pulled the first one. And, uh, what do you know, it comes with the phone turn on. But yeah, and it comes with this. I always like these little stickers. I put them on like, my car, because I'm so high tech. And a little welcome. Biggie. Okay, so here's the phone itself. And it does have the clear little plastic thingy because I still haven't put a screen protector on it. Oh, yeah. I feel like I can shake it better if they're down here. I guess you take it from the back, it's all covered. But it's really nice, really pretty. I guess I'll do it with rose gold. I'm not really stressing over that anymore. But yeah, I guess there's the camera. Compared to my old phone, they, to me, they seem like they're the same size, even though they say that this one is skinnier. I don't know about that for sure, but to me, I just eyeballing it. They feel about the same. The weight feels the same. The button on here also, it's like really hard compared to this button. It's like this one you have to like you click on it and this one's like a yeah. Okay, it has touch screen, duh, and just a little pros. Okay, so the good pros about this camera, it is improved front and rear cameras, it has optical Optical image stabilization. It improves photos, especially in low light. It is water resistant, a faster processor, plus battery, battery, <laughs> plus better battery life. Um, so yeah, and it's just about the same price as iPhone 6 when they first came out. The bad, no headphone jack. That's what I absolutely hate. It has no headphone jack to me. I don't like the headphone jacks. So let me show you what that looks like. They feel like cheap iPhone head, cheap headphones. iPhone, Apple headphones, whatever. And I just feel like they're gonna like get ruined for some reason. But these are long. It's really just flimsy, really weak. I feel like it's just not as great as the regular headphones. So, if you don't want to use these, they do come also with the, the adapter, the changer. So, if you don't want to use those headphones or if you forgot them at home for whatever reason, just plug it up. Put a little brat tail. Just plug it in. Like that. There you go. You have a headphone jack. I hate that Apple did that. Why do we do that? I guess it's one downside to it. Um, I love this screen thingy because I had the regular iPhone 6. I didn't have the 6S. I just think I so. The charger. It looks matte, but I think it's just a little piece of flimsy paper right here over it, so it's actually shiny. Oh yeah, it's shiny. It's just a little matte, mattifying piece of paper. iPhone review, other than just apps and stuff, I mean, 128 gigabytes, like, you ain't ever gonna see me complain. Saying, I want to have I'm overall satisfied with this phone. Thank you. Let me know if you guys like this video. Honestly, I don't even know what the point of this video was other than just showing you the new iPhone just because I know that everyone's just talking about it, raving about it, so I decided, well, why not film it? So, yeah. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Give this video a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe, um, and I'll catch you guys in my next video.